Hi, this is Rhett Miller with Miller's RV, and today I'm standing in front of the much anticipated 2022 Exalta Ranger uh, by Regency, and we're going to get started doing some uh, feature benefit on it. Before we get started on the outside features uh, on the Exalta Ranger, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and make sure you hit the notification bell, and that way you'll get all the updates as we do these videos. Uh, and it'll keep you up on everything that we've got coming in because uh, there are some other products that this company builds that we've got on order and I can't wait to show it to you. Now I'm going to get started on the outside features uh, of the 2022 Exalta Ranger and as y'all can tell obviously I'm on the back of the coach back here. Now you'll notice up top that this coach is equipped with a backup camera and if you've never driven a motorhome, even a small motorhome like this, it's so much nicer because you can't use your rear view mirror to have that to where you can look and not have to get out of the driver's seat. Now again, a little bit of a safety feature, okay? Now, you'll also notice that this coach is full body paint and they paint every body molding at the factory right there in Fort Worth. Great people if you ever get a chance to go up there and see the factory. Uh, they will take care of you. Uh, they're family owned just like we are. Now, again, you'll notice that we have uh, ambulance doors here and I'm gonna swing those open so that you can see how they magnet to the side of the coach. And there again, it's gonna give you an opportunity to load bigger things from the back side of this coach. Now, we'll take the passenger side, swing it across, and then we'll take the driver's side and swing it across. Gotta open it first. Now, this will allow you to put bicycles, kayaks, uh, luggage, uh, larger items that you can load from the back and it really doesn't interfere with the uh, two passengers uh, up in the front. And there again, it does have a step integrated into it, which makes it a little bit easier to get in and out of this coach. And you'll also notice on it uh, that we've got a, a metal rack back here built onto the bottom of the uh, sofa on the driver's side. You can actually take the TV out of this coach and bring it back here and watch TV out here for the tailgaters or anybody who want to watch the news late at night if you're out here enjoying the weather. Now, we're gonna work our way around to the driver's uh, passenger side now. And before we go inside and talk about some of the highlight features uh, and, and benefits uh, on the inside of this coach, I'm here on the passenger side and there's just a couple of things here I wanted to point out to you. Now, what they do is they use a, a fuel OmniStar awning, uh, which is integrated on this side. Obviously, they're again gonna keep you from getting wet, loading and unloading, and also keep all your stuff dry while you're camping. But this coach also has uh, the off-road tire package built onto it with the upgraded wheels. Now this is a two-wheel drive van, but the look on it, because it matches the uh, integrated running boards, it just gives it a completely different look that we really, really like here. Now I'm gonna go ahead and open up the sliding door on this side and then we'll walk inside and look at some features in there. Now before I get all the way inside uh, on this coach on the, on the 144, uh, there's a couple of things right here at the entryway that I wanted to show you that they do that I think that's kind of unique. You have another television uh, set up here to where you can watch TV on this side underneath the awning if the glare is too bad on the back side. And there again, having two of these, you don't see that a whole bunch in the B market. Now the other piece that you're going to see here is actually for the induction stove. Now this is an electric coach as, as far as the cooking on it. So you can actually take this induction stove out of the countertop hook it up here and do you cooking outdoors. That way you don't put the smell and everything on the inside. And plus, why do we go camping? We don't go camping and stay inside. We do it to be on the outdoors. Now we're gonna move inside this coach and go with some features in here. All right, now we're inside the 2022 Exalta Ranger 144. And again, we wanted to go over some of the features and, and, and benefits of what you're gonna get on this coach. Now we did talk about the induction range outside, but obviously if you can use it outside, you can use it inside. Uh, does have the full sink here uh, with solid surface uh, countertops. Another cool feature on here is the flooring in this coach. Uh, this is a really thick uh, vinyl uh, that has some soundproofing built into it. And when you put the bikes and stuff in here, this stuff is tear resistant, scuff resistant. It's very easy to clean. And it's a one piece sheet that they put on before they build everything else. So even if you have a spill in here or a water leak, the water is going to go to the outside of the coach and not damage the floor on this. And don't forget that when you open up your shower system in here, that they've got a rack system built in there. And that way you've got extra storage when you travel. Really the only, you know, I hate to say complaint that we ever get on B-Vans is a lack of outside storage. And what this does is allow you to keep some of that stuff in here and keep it organized while you travel. Um, don't forget that this coach is a lithium, uh, all lithium coach. It's got three 100 amp hour batteries built into this system. And the way it works is it's got a uh, smart battery system built onto it. 
and when the batteries get below a certain charge, there's an indicator that's gonna come on and go off like a small uh, siren, and it's gonna let you know that you need to crank the system and recharge your batteries. TV, uh, what you'll pull out of you can watch from anywhere in the coach, right over here on my right shoulder. Uh, this unit is equipped with the Truma uh, water heater system and coach heat system, uh, and does have a 22,000 BTU rooftop air conditioner. Now, most of the B vans that we have uh, are gonna be a 13,500 to a 15,000 BTU, where this one's got a high efficiency air conditioner that they use that is 22,000 BTUs. That's gonna come in real handy on these hot summer days. And of course, also you've got your uh, Greystone microwave built in over the uh, stove here. Uh, 110 volt refrigerator down below us. And this is equipped with a 12 volt Dometic uh, push button electric flush toilet uh, in the shower area. Uh, and you do have, of course, hot cold water built in there. Uh, and that ties into your Truma system also. Now, y'all can see that I'm sitting on a twin bed setup back here that folds together uh, and makes a big bed all the way across the backside. Now, above me, you can also see that we've got the drop down bunk. So this is a B van again that will sleep for people, uh, which we just don't have a whole bunch of availability out there in the marketplace. And for those uh, rainy times where you actually get stuck inside this, this coach actually has a surround sound stereo built in with a DVD player. Now, I know a lot of the younger people are going to confuse this with a CD player. Uh, matter of fact, we've had a few, few people already joke about it, but it is actually a DVD player that is built into the TV system on it. Uh, and I'll tell you what, the speakers in here, it's really got a little thump to it. You're going to enjoy it. Now, we're going to trade places here, and I'm going to move up front. We're going to talk about the cab area. All right, now we're sitting in the cab area of the Exalta Ranger 144. Um, and a couple other custom features uh, that they do that a lot of other manufacturers don't do, I want to show y'all up here. If you look at the seating up here and also the seating on the twin beds in the back, they actually make their own diamond stitching there and recover all of their seats uh, and all of their cushions right there in the factory. Now there's some advantages to that, obviously. Uh, it's got a little bit better look to it uh, and it's also butter soft if you, if you get a chance to sit in it. But because they make it in-house, it's something that they can readily replace and not have to order from a third party. Uh, so warranty is going to be a little bit easier on that. Now, they also are the only manufacturer that I know of that matches a three-year factory warranty on their coach on anything that they build and install, just like the chassis does. Uh, so again, that's going to set you apart out there, and it's going to give you a longer warranty on, on the unit that you buy. Now, you'll notice up here on the dash that we do have navigation built into this unit. We've also got the smart wheel built into this unit. And of course, this is the new improved power steering that came out two years ago. You can actually turn this thing with one finger even when you're sitting. Uh, it's a very easy unit to drive, uh, and it can also be upgraded with sumo springs if you want to add that to soften the ride up even more. And another cool thing about this cockpit uh, on this Mercedes chassis, uh, and, and again, it's a feature that's been out for a couple of years, but I find that a lot of people don't know about it. The key fob plugs in down here at the bottom and actually recharges itself while the system is running. There's no more watch batteries in there uh, where you gotta take the key fob apart, and most of the time I break it anyway, uh, or you have trouble finding the watch battery. This actually does it for you, and when you try to crank this unit, it will let you know if the key fob is low, and that way you just pop it in there, and when you get to where you're going, you're charged up and ready to go. Now, both of these seats do swivel, turn back around towards the back, uh, and of course, with this you've got I think we mentioned navigation built into it already, uh, but this is a four-cylinder turbocharged uh, three-quarter ton chassis. You can get it in a six-cylinder, but with the four-cylinder on a smaller van like this, you're going to get better than 20 miles per gallon on this coach, and that's the reason that we equipped it the way that we equipped it. So come on down, go to our website, millersrv.com, and come down and take a look at this and test drive this coach. It's the newest product on our lot, and we've got more to come. And remember, enjoy the journey. Hey, thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. Please let us know if you have other questions you want to answer. And if you have nothing else to do, watch one of these videos here. Subscribe so you know when more are coming out. Have a great day and enjoy the journey.